I'm going to be looking for and what people are looking for in the comments is how do you find it's uh, comfort to sit and play like ergonomically, fingerboard and frets, yeah. tuning and style and I'll let you address all of that in your own way. So pretty much I'm going to shut up, let you play and you can talk as, as you see fit. So so far visually, what do you what do you think? Tell, like, do you know about Chapman? You know a little bit, yeah, right? I do. I subscribe to uh, the Andertons. Or, uh, so to both Chappers both, and Andertons. Yeah, I mean, I watch Chappers and Lee, right? Yeah, I watch those guys all the time I watch too. I love their show. Much, yeah, every day, pretty much. Yeah, they're awesome. They have a lot of videos. So. so have you been looking forward to them trying one of these guitars? Didn't even know you could get them in Canada. I thought it was just through their uh, Rift City or I thought it was website. through his. His own company through somewhere in Yeah, America. well he has a number of dealers all across North America. Okay. So more in the States, but there's only one place in Canada. Oh, really? It's Calgary, it's called Guitar Works. Okay. So yeah. I just ordered mine online yeah. and it came. It was fast. Four or five days. So just them? Yeah, it's just them. So do you yeah. know about the range of guitars? Like the, the no, line they have? No, I've seen uh, the videos I've watched, I just saw Whatever he was playing, I don't think he played this one in the video, did he? He's played that one he? tons okay. of times, but he's been playing a lot lately, the ghost fret, that, that sort yeah, of... Yeah, that's the one I recognize, yeah. Okay. What do you primarily play at home? Are you strat Tele. guy? Telly. Telecaster yeah, guy. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, we've got a Mexican telly. So this is pretty similar, like shape. It's light. It's pretty light. Do you find the body lighter than your Mexican telly? Yeah, for sure. What's your Mexican telly? Is it just same... Uh, Same sort of configuration? It's, uh, no, I actually modded it. I took out the, uh, it's got lace sensor pickups. It's oh. Got, like a blue, I did what Johnny Greenwood from Radiohead. Okay. The blue in the neck and then humbucker in the, it's called dually red in the. In the so, neck. like a stacked humbucker or an actual humbucker? It's two single coils that are wired. Together. So, stacked? Yeah, yeah, stacked. Okay, so that's a stacked humbucker also. Oh. Coil taps on the tone. Okay, I think I heard you mention that. So, up is when Coil it's tapped, yeah. What kind of music are you normally into playing? All, all sorts of stuff. Mainly, recently, I'd say in the past year and a half, I've been doing just scales. Just oh, scales. okay. Yeah. So, so you're started, just trying to improve your... I started as, like, just, uh, I used to have a band. Oh, no way. Singer-songwriter. Oh, nice. So I just did open, open strumming for, so I could concentrate on singing. So okay, okay. So you're a singer. Right, yeah. So you're musically talented in a number of ways. I can, yeah, I can sing. I haven't done it about, this is like 10 years ago. Okay. So now, recently... Since I got that AC-15, it totally inspired me to play guitar, like lead and stuff. So oh, yeah? So I'm just trying to learn scales. and The AC-15 is great. Man. Yeah, it's really good. So Do you have the C-2 or the C-1? Single C1, 12? C C1. Yeah, it's loud enough. Like, in my basement, I can't, turn, I can't even turn it up very much. But that thing's huge. 60 watts. Yeah. It's crazy. It's four speakers? Yeah, it's 410. Feel, feel, feel free to play loud, man. Okay. Yeah, neighbors don't mind. Yeah? Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Cool. Yeah, we said a neighbor, right? Next door no, my neighbors are cool. Yeah. So that's out is on, in is off. So that's split right now. That's split. Yeah. That's split. I'm buffer. Screever sounds great. Oh, the lion one for sure. The switch is nice. It feels pretty solid. Yeah. So I, I mentioned I've done a lot of modding and stuff, so I know garbage. Like I saw one of your videos where you had, uh, I think it was a guitar finish. And okay. The control switch was a PCB. Yeah, 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 yeah. It broke off. Yeah. It's actually broke off. That's crazy. Yeah, it's just junk. Junk. Yeah, it's a square. Like you can't solder. It. No, you can't it's solder. What you think it's going? How many frets are on this? Uh, it's 22. 22. I was looking for the markings, I'm not used to that. Oh, it's on the top. Yeah. The top end, yeah. Yeah, it's a bit weird not to have the... Uh, not to 
have the fret markers, but I, I've gotten used to it personally. Yeah. Pretty quick. It's a nice, uh, it's a nice finish on the neck. I have a bunch of different, like I have, uh, I have three tellies. I've got a fat neck. I've got the Mexican's pretty skinny, and that uh, the Jazzmaster is pretty skinny too. So your your guitars, your telly player. So what what? What's the radius on your fingerboard that you're used to? Uh, like a nine or a seven? I think the Mexicans be a nine, wouldn't it? Probably a nine. Yeah, it's a standard. Uh, and the other two I built. Okay. Like one's uh, one's modeled after it's it's like a blonde, and I think it's a fourteen. The neck, I was surprised. So it'd be exactly the same. Yeah, as it's pretty. Yeah, but it's fatter. Oh, okay. So you have fatter. How do you find this neck comfortable? Yeah, well, I'm used to it. Yeah, totally. Like I'm so I. It feels like a telly neck. Yeah. Like it's pretty it's pretty slim, but it's nice. And the fingerboard frets. Yeah, I don't even notice the frets. Like, no. Like there's smooth along. Very nice. <laughs> little infinity symbol when I'm looking yeah. at the front of the fingerboard too. Yeah, it gives me a little clue about where I am. What do you think of the... the how does it feel in your hands, comfort-wise? Like, to sit and play? Fine. Or stand? Yeah, it's, it feels nice. Yeah? It's nice and light. And did you notice that the top is carved? Uh, no. I didn't really notice that. It's carved like a... Oh, yeah, a lot. Like a like a, a Les Paul. That's cool. Yeah, I guess your arm is a bit smoother. One thing I don't I don't really like the open. Uh, I don't like looking at the pickup. Yeah, me either. Side, okay? like me that. either. I, d I like the wood, the grain, and everything, but I don't like seeing the uh, soldering and. Yeah, me either. Because it reminds me of uh, it reminds me of those uh, guitar fetish, you know, the really cheap ones, and the, they had tellies and strats, and they were all open. I'm just like, eh. I don't really and then I think they made some other ones recently that have pick cards and they look yeah. five times better. Like, yeah. I, I threw a Telecaster pick card like, yeah. onto that just to see what it would look like and I personally think it looks fantastic with a pick card. Oh yeah? We'll Trouble is that the, the top is carved so I, I can't just oh, bolt yeah. a pick card to it. Yeah, that's true. I would have to, I would have to, one or? like custom fab one. Oh yeah. Right, because it would need to bend to the contours of the, uh, but I, I, I would I would have preferred this with a with a pick card. I don't know why they do it. That's weird. I would think it's it gets it'll get, it'll get dirty in there, right? Yeah, agreed. It's gonna get full of crap. How do you find tuning it up? Uh, I'm not used to that. Reverse headstock. Yeah, makes me think for a second. Like any of the, 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 the positions so far? Uh, let me try to clean a little bit more. More bass than this? No, no, no. In general, I just mean. Okay. Usually on the neck, there's more bass in the pickups I've been using, anyways. So, so is this what you expected in yeah, terms of tone, yeah. or? Yeah. What gauge are the strings? Those are. That's what it came for. Is ten to forty-six, oh, and those are. That's what I play. Yeah, it's a brand new set of strings. I, I put everybody a brand new set of strings on before oh, they yeah. try. Yeah. That's. What, it feels comfortable to me. I'm used to these strings. You could, 
good player, man. Well, I've been practicing a little bit. Yeah. I don't. I, I really wouldn't want to play lead. I can't do that. So, gun to your head, aesthetics aside, this or the or the mechie. Uh. Two side by side, aesthetics aside. If you could have this in any color you wanted, this or yeah. the this or the tele. Not the not the mechie that I had modded, right? Just a standard. Like Just a like any shot. tele that was sort of in the same price range. This or 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 the Fender Telecaster. Yeah, I wouldn't. I wouldn't not get this for sure. Like it, I definitely consider it. Yeah. Yeah. Put gun force to your head. Gun force to my head. Uh. <laughs> You're uh, listen. You yeah, yeah. Be as honest as you yeah. want, because you're not going to hurt my feelings. I have no, no, no personal no. interest yeah. vested in you. Like you can tell me you think this is the ugliest pile of shit no, no, I ever saw. Think, I think it, it feels like a telly. Yeah. I just think it's a telly. It's kind of like uh, I think I don't know if the new tellies have the uh, the belly cut on the back. U.S. So ones do. The U.S. ones do. Yeah. Yeah. I, 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 I would get it. I would get it for sure. Yeah. yeah. Over the tap. Over the over the. Probably just because it's unique. Yeah. Yeah. And I like. I think they're doing these on the elite now. The yeah, elite. those truss rods are fantastic. They are good, yeah. Oh, superb. It moves like slick like butters. Just, oh, it's here. beautiful. Yeah, the other ones you're just like, you don't feel like you're going to snap it. Oh, uh, the, the, it, it's the, my first guitar with one of those, and I I think it's the best thing since sliced bread. That's cool. And is there anything else that strikes you about it, just in terms of things that... I like the color. I like the, uh, the color. The matching headstock? Yeah. I like those on most guitars. I'm not... I don't really understand why they... Did the they reverse just headstock? Just to be different. Or? Well, the, when they designed these guitars, these were supposed to be internet designed, right? They put them up to a vote and oh, let it? you choose certain, like, do you want reverse headstock? Do you want traditional? So these, all of these were collaboratively designed on the internet. Oh, I didn't know that. Okay. Yeah, so all of the decisions about this guitar weren't made necessarily by Rob Chapman himself. Okay. Right? It, it is. Sure. It's my favorite thing about it. Yeah, I think so too. Yeah, it's, it's really very good. well finished. Yeah, and and feels like it's. I mean, I don't have really big hands. You don't look like you have super large no, hands really either. Not. And I've had guys with big hands tell me they like it. Everybody so far has said they like the neck. Even the guys who said they hated the guitar. Everyone 100% agree that they liked the neck. And I and I have to agree. They nailed it. Yeah, if you put, if I was blindfolded and you put this in my hands, I would think it's a telecaster. A telecaster? Yeah. Oh no, awesome. Yeah, I love those guys. I think, I mean, I... Just the banter between the two. Oh, it's like, so it's, funny. You can tell, it's unscripted. It's just no, like, no, yeah, I mean, those guys are awesome. Well, that's cool. awesome, man. Cool. I appreciate that's you, good. really appreciate you giving me uh, an on-camera.